Welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Coliseum. Let's get back on the road. So, it seems like the majority of this place is made up of tiny ass rooms and long kind of escalators. The floor ones, I can't remember. Is it the same thing? I... I think... I'm not sure. I don't care. Oh yeah, so you're telling me that you'll knock me out of the way? Heh, <laughs> you'll know right away if that's possible by battling me. I'm guessing you have a shadow Pokemon as well, because that other girl did. Just like, other girl? Are you saying I'm a girl? No. I'm guessing that the shadow Pokemon in question is kind of obvious because we've already got one of them and the other one is obviously gonna be... Oh, there's a Shadow Pokemon. Delbert. How wonderful it is to see you on this day, Delbert, or whatever. I don't know what I'm talking about. Astrid. Just whoever comes out of the pile of swine is gonna get crunched. Always go along to do 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 music and very distracting me. Crunch. Nom. Oh, you little chicken shit. Ente. Crush. Glalie, whatever, Glalie, or Glalie, I'm not entirely sure how it's pronounced. But Umbria needs to be out on the field so that we can, I mean, it's stupid really, isn't it? Because it's the only way I can feel like we can actually catch a Shadow Pokemon, is to use Umbrian with secret power. So I haven't got any freaking attacks that can really do, like, the job where it paralyzes or, like, you know, to the, that kind of effect. Never seem to have a Pokemon that can do any of those. Ow. You little shit. Sunny day, and I'm gonna use secret power. Go, secret power, go! Whoa, that did more damage than I was expecting to. Well, he did the job. He's already paralyzed. Go, Pokeball, go! Well, oh, of course not. Let's try this again. Go, Pokeball, go! One, two. Boy. Door. Oh, shit. Door. But he obviously wasn't gonna get Shadow Rush, man. That's another failed one. Damn it! I wonder where we'll encounter this trainer next. Probably in a certain area that I am not going to reveal. Oh, I shouldn't have battled! Your Delphred wasn't very strong and that's why we ended up knocking it out before we could catch it! Why? This happens a lot. 
Well, no, actually it doesn't. It's only happened a few times, but still. To this door here, this is where, like, you see the colors, it's pretty obvious that we'll need, like, to insert, like, each key, that ID thing that we get from each of them. We've got the blue one, the green one, and the red one. And the yellow one is obviously gonna be in this direction. And it's obviously gonna be Ian. Let's just face it, no big secret there. It's pretty obvious. It just seems pointless. Why have this here? Just like, uh, this is like a pointless room. Loads of pointless rooms. Hi, and well, well, so you have come hand in hand like a happy couple on an aimless stroll. We've never been hand in hand, dude. She's just kind of just awkwardly follows around. Well, let me inform you, this is no picnic. You will never defeat me with such a frivolous mind. Oh, come on, we defeated you last time. Face facts, your hair is ridiculous. Right on an acrobat. I don't know where he's going with his strategy of Pokemon here, because, you know, It'd be much more interesting if Pokemon games had a lot more trainers, like, you know, the admins in this game, you know? That they actually have variety. Like, if, like, every gym trainer in a Pokemon game had this variety in their Pokemon, Pokemon games would be a lot more interesting, to be honest. But, no, no, of course not. I forgot the heal as well, that was stupid of me. And it's gonna bite me on the ass because you got a ride on. That's not good. That's great, use crunch. Oh, blast! You gotta be pretty fast, uh, like, be faster than Crobat. Ha! You missed! Your ride on isn't very fast. His defense has gone down. We're gonna play it safe now, are we? We have so pleased. I know you're gonna knock out Sol Dente. But nonetheless, I will take this Crobat down at least. Or not. You troll! Oh. Oh. That wasn't very nice. Man, really can't predict these guys' freaking moves at all. Menti. Go. Oh, you knew I was gonna kick your. Okay, I s I'm guess I'm seeing your pattern now. You're the type of trainer that tends to use protect a lot. I see. Should have known. Right off the bat, when you first used it, I should have known you'd pull this crap on me. And now, uh, well, good, it missed. You fool. I'm gonna eat you. Even though he's a Flygon now, he still hasn't really got any interesting attacks that are of particular interest. Maybe I should check out the TMs. Wow, Van Dean, that was pretty damn good. I mean, I know you have type advantage over him, but still, impressive. A Starmie. Starmie, Starmie, Starmie. Ah, uh, try Blizzard, give it a try. And I shall use, uh, Red Dragon Rap. Oh, you cheap ass. No thunder! Oh man! Teen. A 
Espion. Espion, it's your time to shine again. Because I know how awesomely powerful your attacks are. I forgot, doesn't Crunch have an advantage over Stormy because Stormy is part psychic? Why didn't I think of that in the first place? I'm an idiot, that's why. At least now that, like, um, Mantine got knocked out, we'll get, like, all the XP basically instead of just some of it. Because most of the XP tends to go to Mantine because of the XP share. Yum! Oh, come on, Flygon! Come on! You can do better than that. Psychic. And clutch. Psychic! Ah! Oh. Uh oh. Yeah, it missed. Foolish Starmie Crunch! If Starmie is a genderless Pokemon, then... Uh, wait, no, you can't breed Star, you are Starmie, can you? Why are there so many of them, then? In like that, there's like lords of trainers that use them. And you can catch them and stuff. Oh, there's a shadow Pokemon. There's this thing in there, it's just like, wait, can you get Star You and stuff like that? Easily, in, like in the wild or anything like Pokemon game? So, is it rare encounter? And then it's like, no, it's not like all rare. You know, now that Espion knows Morning Sun, it'll be much more helpful when Espion keeps getting his ass kicked all the time. Send out the Umbreon. Your foe's weak, go ahead on my Umbreon. Side B. I don't know what to say. Ow. You think if Raikou fought it, it'd be thunderous and knock Ian flying against the wall? I think it would. This is a really random thing to say. Needs more power. Oh, come on, why is Raikou got to be faster than Umbreon? Oh, man, I'm really gonna need to spam that move. Oh, crap, now Aspen's paralyzed. Oh, it paralyzed you as well? That's good. Secret power! Morning sun, morning sun. Oh, come on. Why? Why? Just why? Go for it. Yeah, Pokeball of all things, which is not going to be successful because it's pretty obvious. But go, Pokeball, go. It's weird, Pokeball's only useful once. If it fails, then you pretty much it's just like, no, nope, can't reuse the same Pokeball. Yeah, I was hoping for that. Try a great ball then. We 
might be here for a while, folks. One, two, R. Almost time. Yay! Nay! He's not even gonna use Shadow Rush at all, is he? Whoa, 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 slow down there, slow down. What's the hurry? It's weakening him a little more then. Don't knock him out, though. You! <laughs> Why did you do that, Umbreon? Why did it have to be a critical hit of all things? Damn it! Oh, he has improved since our last meeting. <laughs> the way I said that there. Gwah! Gah. It is a shame that you oppose us, Michael. Here, use this. Go on, open the door with it. So bad we can get Raikou. I knew we'd fail at catching one of them, but... But damn it, I shouldn't have chanced it with that stupid critical hit, but... You was in the yellow and not the red, and I knew it'd be really difficult if it was just in the yellow, and then it ended up in the... In the... The black, and he ended up like... No HP bar. It was just completely blanked. It's just like, no. I'm playing the yellow ID match. <laughs> what awaits beyond the door? Why you should see with your own eyes. Hi, Oregon. Uh, excuse me. It's like an interruption, only it's in game this time. Dear Michael, this is Egan of Agate Village. I just wanted to let you know, this is my first electronic mail. I am not familiar with high-tech things, so I may only learn how to... I have only learned how to type in words. Incidentally, if you are ever... In... 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 Uh... Uh... In what? In what? I can't read it! I can't read it because it just goes to the next freaking mail! How do we freaking... how do we... how? Do I press a button of some sort? Uh, no? 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 How do I read this damn message? I press an every button I can, but it just goes back down the freaking thing. It's stupid. I'm changing my ringtone, because that one bugs me. What the fuck? Oh man, there's so many to choose from. I remember, like, the first time... I haven't played this game. I hear that ringtone is like, whoa! And I was like, you know what, let's change it to the scary whenever it pops up a random. It's just like, you just be minding your own business and all of a sudden. It's like, oh, what the fuck was. Oh, you son of a bitch! It's like a jump scare to me, I don't even know why. That one, or. We'll go with Melly too. How do we read this fucking mail? God damn it! Man, I'm not good with this high tech shit. I a freaking uh uh ego or whatever the fuck the name was. Subject. Why can't I read the fucking message? What the fuck? This is absurdly freaking stupid. Uh, your, your message was too damn long. 
Or maybe he was... I'm... I'm... Trying to recall. Maybe he's just stupid. Oh, Grandpa, the email is cut off before he finally gets to the point. Well, what should we do, Michael? Should we go back to Agate Village, or should we keep going? So that's why it wasn't because it was like that. It was because he was an idiot and kind of sent it before finishing it. I'm sure pretty much everyone who uses the internet, which is quite a lot of people, will have had the experience of that at one point in their life where they type something and forget to type the rest of it but send it. Yeah, let's go back to Agate Village then, I suppose. I'll meet you there. We've arrived. Let's see what old man Sniffit wants to say then. I still remember that because... It, uh... Uh... Yeah. I still don't know why I freaking said that that one time. What part was it in? Ah, uh, Yuki and Michael, it's good to see you back. I sent you an email. I'm quite proud of myself for that. We get on it, but it was cut off before we got to anything worthwhile, Grandpa. Oh, is that so? That's odd. Well, since you're here, it would be just as well to tell you in person. Ho, 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 ho. I have a little something I'd like Michael to have. Please take this and sniff it. Obtain the Master Ball! Yeah! Now, Michael Yuki, it's time for you to go. Bring down the criminals in a threatening world peace. Sniff it! Seriously, I, I don't even know why. This is the most random thing I think I've ever said. Well, no, I've said random things, but still. Your grandfather has been studying the instructions intently to learn how to send email to you. So is it more complex than the normal stuff or what? Because usually it's pretty straightforward, isn't it? Or is it one of those needlessly complex things? Because it's just email. I mean, it can't be that tough to figure out, old man. I don't know. Well, anyway. I like this music here, so... Let's let's dance with the Sudoto. Well, more like walk around with the Sudoto. This is fancy, man. If only if they had a mod in The Sims 2, where the fountain is turned into a rotating Sudoto, that would be quite satisfying. Quite satisfying indeed. But of all Pokemon, a Sudowoodo, it's just like, the, the honoring mirror be with that? Probably not, but it seems kind of random. Uh, well anyways, uh, we'll continue onward with this Relgum Tower in the next part. See you next time, viewers. See you next time. Awesome music.